Okay, in this game, what we're going to do is add some sound effects. And sound effects really make your game just that much more lively and uh, realistic. It gives us a trigger so we hear something and we look on the screen to see what's happening. It also makes it feel like that is actually more realistic and actually happening. So one of the things we're gonna do is make a sound effect when we hit the coin. So if we take a look at how our game is set up, you'll notice we grouped everything so it's easy to find things. So although they weren't necessary because we have our groups, I know, oh, score is where I did coin. And you'll see right here is player is in a collision with a coin. So what I want to do is I want to um, just talk about a, a mistake I made the first time. And uh, this is my second take of the video. Um, and so don't do this. I just want to show you uh, what not to do is you'll notice this is the player's in collision with the coins. And right here is where I need to add the action. I need to add the action in this uh, deleting of coins. In this second condition, this is always going to happen. And I accidentally did the following. So let me just show you what I accidentally did. Um, I'll just erase this. So this is what not to do, and then I'll show you what to do. Um, because I imagine there's going to be a student that's going to accidentally make this mistake. They say, great, players in collision with a coin, and they click here in the second one. And the two aren't grouped together. The second one has no conditions. It always happens. And so you go and look for play a sound. And we'll just type play, play a sound. And then because we're using the online version, um, I have to choose, I can't upload a sound. So I choose an audio file from the library. And the audio file I'm going to choose is coin. So there you go. Uh, so it says, great, play this file here. Super. Uh, and then repeat the sound. And then I'm going to put uh, no. Then I press OK. OK, so what's going to happen is, as I was trying to get at, these two are not grouped together. A lot of students are going to think that they are. But if you look at it, this condition, there is no condition. So it's always going to do the second one. So really, when I, the player is in the collision with a coin, it's going to do just these things. Okay, and so it's really important that we make sure we put it in the right spot. So what it's going to do right now, it's going to, there's no condition here. So it's going to always play the coin sound. So let's hit play and see how it goes. And you'll see that this is not what we want. Uh, it's just going to be beeping like crazy. Okay, that is annoying. So what we need to do is I'm going to click on here and I'm going to delete that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add it to the right spot. So player is in collision with the coins. We're going to delete the coins. We're going to add one to the number of coins. And I click add action right here. And then I'll do play a sound. A property this time uh, so play a sound and then I can choose the coin uh, sound that I have here in the game okay um, while we're at it it's uh, I'm going to show you how to do the enemy as well so with the enemy again we look at the different things that happen and what I want is when I hit it and kill an enemy uh, and so you'll see ah right here is how I deleted an enemy and you'll see that's when the player hit the enemy and the player is not on the floor we delete the enemy. So great. So here is where I can work on adding a sound effect for the enemy. So piece of cake, all I do is I click here, um, add an action. So this is where I'm deleting the enemy. I'm going to play a sound. And if I look at the audio files, you'll see uh, there's not a lot. There's uh, six sounds. So uh, they, they didn't give us a lot uh, built in. So what I'm going to do is just do the shield down that when I thought it sound, sounded good enough. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is, and I can change the order, I can play the sound and then delete the enemy. So I'm going to play the sound and then I'm going to delete the enemy. So let's test out the game and um, see how it sounds. And you'll see uh, when I get here, it just kind of adds a bit to uh, the game. Now, another thing I want to show you while we're at it here is I made it so if I fall, I didn't fall forever. And I made it so, oh, there's 
some more adventure down here. And I made it so that you might likely fall or, or you could accidentally get to this point. And so I think that added to the game as well. Uh, one last thing is as I'm going through and, and making my levels more advanced, um, this was too easy. So I wanted to make it like, okay, I'm gonna make it a bit more of a challenge. Um, so what I did is I'm gonna play here and I'm gonna see, okay, if I have my step here, how high could I jump, for example, up to that one? No, I couldn't. So that's too far. So, uh, and so I, you wanna make it, so there's gonna be some things that are gonna be a little bit challenging to get and can get you into uh, some, some tough spots. And so I'm just gonna uh, go here and say, okay, let's take a look. And if I jump up, I can see, well, I can jump up a fair bit more, oh shoot, uh, than I had there. And so I'm just gonna test how far I can uh, jump and, and move to make it so it's it's not quite too easy. And actually, I guess it wasn't that easy because I did fall, but um, you're gonna see here, I'm gonna make it so, see this guy can go up and could go a little farther. Um, so I can make this one a little bit, uh, uh, a little bit uh, harder. So I'm gonna drop uh, the uh, ladder here or the um, bridge piece and I'm gonna drop it just about another uh, centimeter. So let's do that. Um, I won't uh, bore you with it, but I just wanted to uh, show you here. So I'm gonna uh, move my screen over and I'm gonna take this one here and just drop it just like that. And you'll see this now is much more of a, a challenge to get at and, I'm, um, and even I might move this one. Uh, in fact, I might move uh, that one like so over quite a bit. So uh, now it's a bit of a trick. You're going to have to jump to there, to jump to there, to jump to there, and just be able to get there. Okay, so uh, keep working, adding some sounds. Uh, um, one of the things that uh, I won't demonstrate here uh, because I'm using the online version, but sometimes you might want to have a uh, background music when the scene starts. And so I'm gonna just show you how to uh, uh, do that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the game events. And this time uh, I've got, uh, basically um, I'm gonna add a new event. Um, so I'll create a new event. And this is going to be uh, when the scene starts. Uh, so my action is going to be at the beginning of the scene. And so I just start typing at the beginning of the scene. And so um, when the scene first starts, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, play some music. And if I take a look, play a music file, uh, which is great, except for if I go to my library, I don't have any music files. <laughs> and so unfortunately we have to use the desktop app to do this, but you could put in, if you have a, a favorite MP3 uh, and you think, great, that kind of adds to the game. Uh, you could put that on here as well and, and play some background music. So feel free to try that out. Um, I can't demonstrate on the online version. And if you're just using the online version, obviously uh, that won't work. Um, so I'm just gonna hit cancel here. Um, I believe it might work if you have the file at a URL, and I haven't actually tested that. Um, but you know, uh, for those that are really, uh, so I'll delete that for now. But that's how you would add uh, background music to your whole game. Okay, so that will conclude today. Uh, see if you can add some sound effects, and really uh, make sure your game level is tricky um, and. Go through the bugs and, and different actions and uh, things to make it as good as possible. We're going to make our uh, home screen and then we're going to actually publish it to the um, internet is my goal.